Is your iPhone randomly restarting or stuck in a boot loop? Maybe it works for a few minutes and then shuts off again. Whether the issue is caused by a bad app, a software bug or even a hardware problem, this step-by-step -step guide will help you fix it and get your iPhone running normally again. Let's dive in. Start with a force restart. This isn't a normal restart. It's a deeper system refresh that can break a restart loop or freeze. It doesn't delete anything and it usually works when your iPhone is unresponsive or stuck on the Apple logo. To force restart, press and release the volume up button, press and release the volume down button and then press and hold the side button until the Apple logo appears on the screen. Outdated software can cause bugs, including restart loops. If your iPhone stays on long enough, go to Settings, General, tap on Software Update and install the latest version of iOS. These updates often include bug fixes that can resolve crashing or restart issues. Some third-party apps, especially the ones that haven't been updated in a while, can crash your system. You can check for these by going to Settings, Privacy and Security. Here tap on Analytics and Improvements and then tap on Analytics Data. If you notice an app name popping up repeatedly in crash logs, that app might be causing the problem. Uninstall it and see if your iPhone stabilizes. Did this start happening after you installed a new app? Even if the app is from the App Store, it could still be incompatible or buggy. Try deleting any apps you added just before the problem began. Some apps running in the background might be causing your iPhone to restart or crash. On your iPhone, go to Settings, tap on General. Here, tap on Background App Refresh and turn it off for all the apps temporarily. See if the issue improves. A weak or failing battery can cause your iPhone to randomly shut down and reboot. In Settings, tap Battery and then tap on Battery Health. If the battery's maximum capacity is under 80% or you see service recommended, it might be time to replace it. The next step you should take to fix iPhone crashing is resetting all settings. This won't delete your photos or apps, but it will reset system preferences like Wi-Fi passwords, screen layout and privacy settings. You can do this by going to Settings, General. Here tap on Transfer or Reset iPhone. Then tap on Reset and finally tap on Reset All Settings. If a bad setting or corrupted config file is causing the issue, this can fix it. If your iPhone is stuck in a loop and you can't access the settings, you may need to restore it using a computer. Connect it to your Mac or PC using a USB cable. Then put it in recovery mode and choose Update to reinstall iOS without deleting your data. You can find instructions on how to put an iPhone into recovery mode in the description of this video. If none of the steps work, the problem might be hardware related. This includes a damaged logic board, faulty power button or battery connector issue. In that case, your best option is to visit an Apple store or authorized repair provider. That's how you can fix an iPhone that keeps restarting, stuck on boot loop or keeps crashing. I hope one of these solutions worked for you. If it did, hit the like button and consider subscribing for more iPhone tutorials, fixes and tech tips. Thanks for watching.